Hello friends, today we will learn about an aspect of Stoic philosophy which is Amor Fati. Now what is Stoic? Stoic means to suffer pain or difficulty in your life without making any complaints. And what is Amor Fati? Well, this is a Latin word which has been used a lot by Frederick Nietzsche in his writings and his quotations are given in the description area of this video. So check that. And Amor Fati would mean that you accept life as it is. You love your life as it is. So now you may ask me, does it mean that you become lazy or does it mean that you just say yes to everything that comes in your life, good or bad? Well, let's check that out. Watch the video till the end. And if you are here for the first time, do subscribe to this channel, Inner Universe Community. Here we go. You always want the best to happen to you. You want that high paying job. You want the right break. You want that much awaited promotion. You want your child to score really good marks in the examination. But you also know that it does not always happen as you have planned or thought. Now, what is the solution? Analyze where you went wrong and make changes. Maybe the employees were wrong. So do you get into the blame game? No. Here is where the concept of Amor Fati becomes useful. It means to accept whatever happened in your life and now get up again and carve a new path for yourself. If your business failed, try Amor Fati. Try again. Work on the causes that led to the failure of your business. Amor Fati is a Latin term which has been used a lot in Frederick Nietzsche's writings. Let me explain Amor Fati to you in simple terms. 1. Amor Fati means to love your fate or accept your fate. That is, instead of resisting, you accept and prepare yourself to face what comes your way. 2. Amor Fati means not getting stuck in your negative past experiences and move on with a change in mind and a change in your attitude. 3. Amor Fati means Everything happens for good. Learn the lesson from every experience in life. 4. Amor Fati would also mean accepting the isness of what is. Just let it be if you feel that something is beyond your control. 5. Amor Fati means don't run away from the problem. Don't blame yourself or feel guilty. Just become a witness to the whole situation and come to a better and creative decision or solution. 6. Amor Fati means not to worry or become too anxious about the future and just enjoy and accept your present moment, that is, be in the now. 7. Amor Fati means to embrace your life as it is while learning and making changes to become better. 8. Amor Fati doesn't mean that you shun work, and become lazy. It means that you love life, accept life with its highs and lows and walk on with faith in yourself and in God. It means that you are open to change rather than sulking about the past. 9. The concept of Amor Fati helps to save your precious energy by not worrying and thinking of creative ways to live life. Here is an example for you. Mr. Z wanted to become a singer. He tried really hard for many years but couldn't succeed as a singer. So, 
he switched over to sound recording and eventually he set up his own studio now he is successful in his field of work and is around musicians he understands them well too because of his own previous experience as a singer amor fati inspires you to be in the present moment delete past negative experiences and have faith in whatever the future holds for you without getting fearful or anxious when my daughter was suffering from chickenpox and had to stay home for nearly a month instead of complaining that she was missing her tuitions and school she began enjoying as she lay on bed and was confined to her room she listened to music watched films and slept to her heart's content she relaxed and enjoyed the time to the maximum instead of complaining about her pain or getting anxious about how she would complete her course this knowledge came inherently in her this is amor fati so everything that happens in your life good or bad comes to teach you something and mold you into a better person when my mother died i felt very sad for some time but then i changed my thinking and began giving gratitude for the fact that she did not have to bear any further pain and suffering i began doing things that she loved doing and recalled all the happy moments we had spent together this is amor fati nothing is good or bad it is our thinking that makes it so so in a universe community keep moving keep learning keep progressing towards your desires and goals with renewed enthusiasm come what may that's amor fati for you love your life this is sanchita pande your mentor and spiritual guide i love you may peace be with you my blessings are always with you may you enter a life of abundance and good health and love thank you so much namaste